We're here in London recording Beethoven's Violin Concerto and the two romances, G major and F major. Beethoven has played a crucial role in my whole life, especially in my childhood. I feel the language of his music combines tragedy, heroism, joy, all the sort of elemental aspects of uh, being a human being. And my journey on the violin really began with this concerto, so I really feel in many ways this is the most important moment in my entire career. And it's a momentous task to even sort of conceive of recording something that's obviously been played by every great violinist, has a huge, heavy tradition behind it. And it's so naked and exposed. The, the violin part is essentially scales and arpeggios. The purity and simplicity is exactly what moves people. And so capturing something that's both personal to me and a reflection of my relationship with Beethoven, but also not tampering with that purity, with that simplicity, is a challenge. And one has to not overthink it and just enjoy the, the, the process that we have here. And uh, my comrade in this process is uh, my good friend Oleg Kaitani, who's a wonderful conductor and I've known for a number of years now. And we actually spent um, part of the lockdown together in Florence. Charlie has an apartment in Florence and there we met and we began to play music uh, together. I played the piano and he played the violin. We spent some time coming up with ideas, tempi and various sort of bowing articulation ideas in the solo part, in the orchestral part and it became a natural uh, collaboration to make this um, together. The Harmonia Orchestra is a lovely orchestra. It's an orchestra that has a real tradition, a tradition that you feel in the sound. Before, but the Philharmonia Orchestra, obviously, one of the historic great orchestras in the world, and it's a privilege to be able to do this um, with them, and they sound fantastic. They have an enthusiasm and a love for music that is uh, contagious. Classical music, Beethoven, this particular pieces, they have the power to bring us together, the power to make us realize how universal and um, connected we all really are. And um, it's the most, the highest form, I feel, of human communication, music. <laughs> 